One of the most amazing features in the highveld of Mpumalanga in the municipality of Msukalikwa is the high rate of erosion within the valleys that are found in the area. This particular valley behind me is in actual fact the Val River which of course uh, brings water to millions and millions of South Africans all over the country. The most amazing thing is the natural features that have in actual fact uh, evolved over millions of years within this valley system. What we have behind me is the naturally formed stone bridge which is an erosion bridge that has in actual fact eroded probably over the last five million years. What you have is you have um, uh, a softer type of rock underneath uh, a very hard sandstone layer and as the water has percolated over the many millions of years through the system uh, the, the softer ground and, and, and shale has in actual fact been eroded away and has left a hard sandstone layer over the top and uh, what we have is now a natural what is called a bow bridge which is something which is, is quite incredible it's probably one of the best known features of this particular area in ancient times this would have in actual fact been the footbridge for many of the people like Zulu Impis and Swazis and also your, your, your bushmen would have in actual fact utilized this bridge to actually cross over the Val River. The most exciting thing that has um, emerged over the last few years with some of the investigations that we've done is we have found out that the British uh, uh, invading forces during the Anglo-Boer War during the rainy periods were unable to cross over the Val River and they actually utilized this natural bridge to actually cross over the Val River. Fur trekkers as well utilized this bridge to in actual fact um, access from the western side of the Val River over to the eastern side of the Val River by in actual fact using the area to actually cross over. Of importance at the end of the time is that there even exists evidence of an area on the other side of the bridge where the area, the rocks have actually been cleared away to make it easier for the wagons to in actual fact to turn away from. In terms of visual beauty, this is probably one of the most visually beautiful examples of natural features and heritage features which exist in Mpumalanga.